What's up guys, the Amigo Boys here and I am back with another crafting session. Today we're going to meta craft an item that was made with the recent uh, kind of uh, awaken orb exploit thing. Um, yeah, we were able to make this insane base here on Hubris Circle. Legacy Arc uh, Triple Chain uh, Enchant. Then it has the uh, Del Mods, the Fossil Mods, Increased Energy Shield, Underground and uh, lightning resist and blast chain mine so this base here is uh, one in a one of a kind I believe and today we're going to try and meta craft the uh, ES prefixes onto it so yeah let's just jump right into it we're going to block mana because I believe that has more tiers than the life and uh, actually we don't want the LA damage because that's tier 2 anyways we're gonna do suffix cannot be changed and uh, scour it and then we're ready to go. And we hit life. <laughs> oh shit, we can actually roll the... Yeah, the shaper prefixes, right? And the wallet prefixes. So this is going to be a little bit harder to... Uh, than I anticipated. So I've just going to be changed. Ah, uh, tier 3 hybrid. I guess it blocks some mods. This is T1 uh, flat and mana. That might actually be be decent now that you cannot craft a high hybrid. So, um... Hmm. No, you know what? Fuck that. Yo, let's try and save that one. And maybe we can... Stuff is gonna be changed. And all. We did save it. Let's go again. Uh, mana. We don't want that. Because I'm thinking if we can slam like T1 flat on top of there, could actually be good. Let's go again. So it's going to be changed now. Saved it again. Increase the AOE level 20. I don't want that. It needs to have energy shield because it has the energy shield suffix. Wow. <laughs> Three times in a row? Four times in a row to hit the craft. Five times in a row. Imagine if I could do that when I had a good mod and I could actually save it so many times. Area of effect. It's like the only thing I'm hitting is like area of effect. Yeah, there we go, it's dead. Life can actually block some tears. Coal damage dispels. Oh god, there's so many prefixes now that I think about it. This is gonna be a hard craft. Tier 1 hybrid. Uh, guess it can block some tears for slamming the other one. Yeah, because now we hit T2, right? Or How much ES does it have if I craft flat? Just to see. Because I mean, it's pretty much max roll. Okay, I'm out of Alks, but let me go and have a building uh, this one. It will probably be around 4 or 380. Let me check by building real quick. Uh, control C. So, this one will be at 365. No, wait. Will be at 378. 
and if I instead get um, T1 flat and T1 percent, it would be at it would be at 380, but it would have an open, uh, more open prefix. Hmm. I guess I gotta keep going, right? It's just it kind of sucks because I finished it so fast, and it's actually pretty rare to get, like, I don't know, guys. What what are your thoughts? Let me just check the chains on PV Craft. Shaper, cause like it's one in one in sixty to hit the ES, and one in sixty to hit the percent. So it's gonna be a uh, like a lot of exalts, probably like three K something. No wait, that's not right. Is it? Yeah. Cause previews are pretty fucking expensive. Um What do you guys think? Yeah. We gotta keep going. I mean, you can get the same ES, uh, the exact same ES in an open prefix if I hit T1 flat at T1%, because then we can craft like Fist Taken is fire. Or plus one. Plus one would actually be huge because give you another plus one on this setup you have in here. Okay, flat plus hybrid, how much would that be? Um. So that would be up to twenty five plus sixty one, that's eighty six flat. And it would be fifty plus seventy four at one twenty four percent. That would be uh four hundred and eleven yes. That would be really good actually. Four hundred and eleven. If we if we get T T one flat on top of the um hybrid flat yeah so I mean I guess I guess keep going or something we can we can beat this one yeah the hybrid is like oh I don't know because it's not even T1% if it was T1% and T1 uh, hybrid I would I would keep it, but it can still reach nine percent higher. So it's like it's gonna be three eighty a three eighty one. Oh, but plus before I didn't have the T one flat, and I had uh, I didn't have T one flat and hybrid flat on top of each other. I was trying to slam for that, but I never hit the T one flat, the sixty one. Yeah, I was going for that, but I didn't. So. Yeah, let's keep going. Let's keep going. Try and save it. Maybe save the percent. Oh, which didn't happen. Let's try and okay. Let's try and slam for T one percent then. Or uh, T actually even T one flat is good. Cause then we just craft the percent on it. All right, let's go. Mm. No, wrong, wrong mud. Okay, yeah, now it's dead. Scour it. Hmm. 
Yeah, bad mod. Power charge and kill. Like, I haven't even looked into all the options we can get. From the uh, Warlord prefix. I have no idea. Is it T1 hybrid again? And 40. 40% 40 ES tier 6. Yeah. Ew. Let's try and save it. Uh, saved? Nice. <laughs> Rarity. Wow. And it died. Life. AOE. No, thank you. Rarity. I, I don't think rarity is enough tears that it's even worth double slamming on it. AOE. Dude, come on. I don't want that. Make it an ES, ES chest. Thorns. How many tiers of that? Um. <laughs> Two tiers. Um, no thanks. But yeah, so I was talking with Casta and he said that the Arakan chain is actually insane for PvP. Because uh, apparently PvP boys here in Standard, they use Arc Because it's auto-target. Okay. Tier 2%, let's go. Let's go slam that. <laughs> no! <laughs> I read something with 60 and I hoped it was yes, but it was not, it was life. <clears> Tier <throat> 6 flat. Damn. Okay, again, tier two percent and some life. Trying to know, craft again. Trying to know, it ripped. Let's just try and slam for fun without changing the meta mod. Oh, rip. Okay, <laughs> tier 5 hybrid, um, no thanks, I don't even think it has enough tiers to uh, to be worth blocking, look at this, 6 tiers, I think it's enough, but we hit life, uh, rip, and uh, no thank you, blast chain my, no wait, no, there's actually a T1 flat. Oh, wow. Try and save the flat then. We can divide it up to 61. Oh, shit. It's gone. Well, yeah, that's right. Like, the flat has such a big uh, range. I remember that back in the day. I actually used to just search for stuff with low rolls and on um, PoE trade and then just divide them up because I ended up just to flip them because I could gain like 30 years or something by divining and 
yeah, life. Uh, test tiers. So yeah, when you double slam, you just want to get an item. Like if it's a shit mod, you can just hope it has a lot of tears so it can block and make the changes of the other slam uh, much better. But either way, if you get something good, you gotta annul it, and that's a 50-50 chance. Okay. Ah. Bad mods. Let's go. <laughs> Tier 5. Um, no. Because we're starting to run out of scours here. Uh, yeah, I mean, he can block actually, he can still block. So, there we go. Trash. T2 hybrid, uh, <laughs> T2 hybrid and tier one flat hybrid. Are we gonna save the flat hybrid? Let's go. <coughs> we lost the craft, and it's saved. Okay. Now the best thing we could do now is either. Uh, it's probably actually just slam. Yeah, slam uh, T1 flat on top. But I mean T1 percent would be also uh, pretty nice. So let's do that. Let's go. Hmm. <laughs> Power charge and kill. Wow. And it died. Are you kidding me? Oh shit, I cannot miss I'm misclicking. Okay. Uh yeah, two two we can block it probably. I haven't met the crafted helmets in such a long time. And I've always had the worst luck when metacrafting these. I I used to do it uh, back when I had some Hawa helmets, but I never hit something good on those. Like with the uh, uh, Legacy and Molten Strike enchant. So this is gonna be changed. Go back. <laughs> yeah, rip. Life can block mods. And uh, tier six percent. 
Is it true I haven't seen a percent ES T1 yet? I think I've only seen a couple T2s. <laughs> Minion gems. Oh. Interesting. Okay. G1 flat mana hybrid. Let's go. Huh. And the hybrid ES on tier 4. Um, no thanks. I don't want that. Let's get rid of it. There we go. Let's go with mana. Now we're going to slam tier 1 ES. Yeah, tier 4. <laughs> Not good enough. But it got saved. Let's go again. Uh, what? Fist taken as fire. I didn't know we could even roll that, dude. Alright, we don't want that. We really need the ES prefixes. If it was a life based chest, you would have a lot more freedom. You could have life and then just anything else. Like, do you want life? Anything else is good. This one, though. Kind of forced into ES because, uh, or else you have a wasted suffix. And also, I believe most miners they go uh, go low life, or maybe if it's, if it's for PVP, I guess so they could also go CI because chaos damage can kind of be a bitch. So being immune to something is really strong. Like I'm feeling like I'm just throwing exalts in the air right now, but we gotta hit it at some point. Just hope I don't get broke, cause I'm already in a little bit of debt because I was uh, lending, I was borrowing some X from a guy who lent me uh, to do the awakener trick. I used to way too much currency in the last couple of days. Yeah, but I guess it paid off because it didn't get wiped. The item stayed. It's like synthesis 2.0 just for a few days. Like just hurrying up. It, it was the same in synthesis. Like I've never been so excited to craft but also had so much stress in my life because it was the same with synthesis when they announced that synthesis was not going core. Like dude I freaked out. I wanted to finish so many bases. It was insane. It was like just every day crafting as much as you can trying to leave synthesis with as much stuff as possible okay that was how many eggs you got I think that was 200 exalts <laughs> nah. actually I thought we had used more if it's only 200 then we can keep going like that's just a couple services on this helm and it's probably never gonna get beat because now it has a legacy enchant, it has a legacy uh, minor mod. Yeah. This is the good stuff with waiting to craft until it's patched. You will check if other people did the same. If not, then just go ham on crafting and you have like some unique items. I think most people were doing the physical weapons and that was. Uh, I mean, I made a bow for personal use, but that's pretty much it. <laughs> Thorns, uh, no thanks. Just <laughs> instantly scour that shit. It has only two tiers. Oh. I'm starting to run out of scours. Does any of you guys have uh, scours? So we're gonna have to buy some. Cause I'm running out now. Actually, wait. I guess I can buy some for chains orbs in the town, right? 
That's something I used to do back in the day. Just if the if the ratios on PoE trade and all that were really fucked, you could actually make profit just from uh, vendoring these, or getting these for freedom for chains orbs. Ikea if scours were like two to one, and the chains orbs were ten to one, you could make two chains orbs profit every time you sold the scour. I used to do that when I was a broke noob. Okay, lighting damage to spells. Oh, fuck. Okay, I guess if we hit T1 flat with this one, we're gonna keep it. Because this is actually GG for mines. Oh, we. <laughs> Get the fuck out of here. Let me hit T1 LE damage. Like, what can I even do with this? Why why is why is Chris doing this to me? If this was a life based helmet, dude. Oh my fucking Let's just take like one minute of uh silence for this this insane helmet that could exist and yeah, shouldn't. Because it's on an ES base. Wow. If I didn't have this suffix with energy shield, I would literally be freaking happy right now. Just craft life and be done, but... Yeah. <laughs> exactly, at least... <laughs> gotta save it. Hit the life, come on. Save it and hit T1 energy shield. T1 flat. So I was gonna be changed. Scout. Oof. Rip. Rip. That was in a sick ass combo right there. But it didn't have any use. The thing is, though, these mods are very rare. <laughs> I haven't seen them as much as I've seen ES, so they're probably weighted rarer, and I hit both of them at the same time. It's crazy. That's pretty sick. We hit Blazing, T1 ES, on the double slam. Let's send all the other one off. Because it's T2. If it was T1 hybrid uh, ES, it would, uh, it would be a keeper. There we go. Nice. Now let me just check the odds of slamming. Okay, I cannot see it exactly because PoE Craft doesn't support um, two influence. But let's say I have flat on here. Ooh. Okay, I got flat. We have blocked mana. This means my chance to hit 21% is 2.3. Right, and if, if we want to keep T T two as well, that's like four point six percent or four point seven percent. Then we can also hit the hybrid flats. That's another four point seven on top. It's like ten percent chance to hit something good. I'll take the odds. I'll take the odds. And I hit life. <laughs> Shit. If we can save it and just keep going, man, with a ten percent chance of hitting something good, it's really nice. So it's gonna be changed and all, and it died. Damn. Ouch. Yeah. So T1, uh, this one. Can it flat? Let's go. We hit cold. Saved. Hit forms. Try and save it. And it's dead. Come on, man. We just gotta finish this item. AoE, instant uh, restart. Not enough tears. 
sadly. Yeah, Fladius, wow. Let's craft expensive mana now, I don't care. Maybe it gives us better luck. Tier 4 ES and a bad tier of the flat hybrid. The good thing is the flat hybrid is actually pretty good because there's two tier like there's two different ones with it. There's one with energy shield and mana and there's one with energy shield and life. So you can hit and the both are with energy shield. So we can hit either and get something good. So that's actually really dope. Yeah, this is an instant uh, restart. Refresh the item. And again, don't want these shaper prefixes. Unless uh, they actually block each other. I guess I can check that on PWDB. Because if you cannot get both added fire to spells and added lightning to spells stuff like that they could actually be worth to have um, to block because I know that's the case on wands okay it doesn't seem to be the case on here um, so yeah let's scour it off because wands even though it doesn't say it they can only roll one added damage type to spells I have no idea why they did that because it, it wouldn't even be that broken, but yeah. Guess it's GGG being GGG. Alright, so we have tier 2 percent. If I can hit tier 1 flat on this, it will literally be done. I will be so happy. <laughs> and then we hit tier 10 life. The worst tier of them all. Uh. Yeah, let's save this one. I still haven't hit T1% uh, percent yes yet. There we go, guys. It is officially over tier 2% two and tier 1 flat. Nice. GG. I don't even care. It's 9% yes, dude. Fuck that. It's such a good helmet. Because we will divine this one to perfect and then we will either craft. I guess it's actually really bad just to craft a hybrid here because it's so shit. So, I mean, we could craft plus one projectile. Might be good, I don't know. Plus one AoE. Or, um, physical taking his fire. Either way, um, very good. Craft stuff is gonna be changed, and then we will just start getting a lot of divines. GG, guys. We hit that. I had about. 580 when I started so 300 exhausts dude to hit this prefix is actually not bad I'm really happy about that didn't waste too much more I can get like three copies on it and it will be paid off so um yeah let's go and buy some divines let's be back now we got some divines let's go divine it and yeah so we want like 140% and then 61 flat. This is two off. I mean, uh, we're gonna go for one off. Needs to be one off. So the vines are the cheap part. <laughs> wow, I'm not even hitting the 61 ES at all. What's going on? There you go. There you go. Need 61 and then 140.
<laughs> 61 and then 139. Uh, no. We're selling for one off. Perfect. <laughs> 130. I actually think I just rolled over it before. It was like 60 and then 141. There we go. Did I just reroll perfect? Oh shit. Yeah, but we got it here. One off. It's fine. <laughs> Day, I must be really tired then. Fuck me. Anyways, there we go, guys. Let's just crap something on it here. Do amulet? No, dude. I won't do the amulet now because I don't have time for it. I gotta go in like 30 minutes. And uh, that one is gonna get me so much in depth, it's gonna be not fun. <laughs> gonna do it at some point later. 21. Uh Oh, it's so close to being 400 ES. Actually, let me just get plus one AOE on here. It, it will look better. Yeah, fizz as or plus one AOE. There you go. Alright, 370. Thank you so much, guys, for tuning in. Amazing craft, legacy arc chain, 370 ES. Plus one mine and all that good stuff. Minus lightning resist. GG.